Hello friends, let us solve some. So let us take vector 3, 6, minus 9 and blank have same direction ratio. Have same direction ratio. So here we are having the option says 1, 2, 3 pi, 2 pi, 3 pi, then minus 1, minus 2, 3 and 1, 2, 0. So this is not difficult. You can have uh, just by looking to the 3, 6, minus 9 and uh, we can take say 3 outside so it is 1, 2, minus 3 or even you can take like uh, the direction of uh, 3, 6, minus 9 and uh, the direction of uh, say we can again take minus 3 outside because of this so this is minus 1 minus 2 and 3 so minus 1 minus 2 3 so these are having the same direction ratio so answer is C ok next if vector A is minus 3, 1, 0 and vector B is 1, minus 1, minus 1 then component of vector B in the direction of A is blank options are 4 by root 10 root 3 by 4 minus 4 by root 10 minus root 3 by 4 now we know the formula for component of B along the direction A as a dot b but now divide by magnitude a ok here we need to take care about the a direction is there so we are given all these things minus 3 1 0 dot 1 minus 1 minus 1 and the magnitude of vector a so it is 9 plus 1 plus 0 so this is easy to find so this is minus 3 then minus 1 then 0 over square root 10 so this is minus 4 over square root 10 so the option again C ok next the area of a parallelogram whose diagonals are say j vector plus k caret and i plus k is blank <coughs> option root 3 by 2 then 3 by 2 3 root 3 now we know the formula for uh, area of a parallelogram but when the diagonals are given so we know when the diagonals are given suppose a bar and b bar diagonals 
then its area equal to one and a half and the cross product of the <coughs> diagonal vectors so a bar is j plus k so this is 0 1 1 and uh, say b bar is uh, i plus k and so it is 1 0 1 and uh, so we find a cross b and a cross b is not difficult to find i j k this is 0 1 1 1 0 1 and uh, so this is i this 4 1 then minus j so then you are having uh, minus j so here 0 and 1 so this is 0 1 and 1 so it is minus 1 and uh, plus k this 4 so 0 minus 1. So we are having i plus j and minus k. So this is 1, 1, minus 1. And its magnitude is root 3. So the area equal to 1 half into root 3. So root 3 by 2 square units. Okay. So that is the answer, option A. Okay, next. Magnitude of projection of minus 1, 2, minus 1 on i is blank. Options are 1 by root 6, minus 1 by root 6, 1, minus 1. So again we are having the formula and the formula is magnitude of projection of A say equal to minus 1 to minus 1 on I Okay, and that is 1, 0, 0. So the formula is, if this is say B, then it is modulus of A dot B over modulus B. So that is a modulus of minus 1, 2, minus 1 dot 1, 0, 0 over modulus p is here 1 and so this is not difficult it is minus 1 in its magnitude so that is nothing but 1 so answer is 1 ok next if a bar is a non-zero vector then number of unit vectors collinear with a bar is plain. Options are 
वन टू थ्री इनफाइनाइटली मैनी सो क्वेश्चन लेट अस अंडरस्टैंड ए बार इज ए नॉन जीरो वेक्टर नंबर ऑफ यूनिट वेक्टर्स नाउ यूनिट वेक्टर इज ए बार अपॉन मैग्नीट्यूड ए बार एंड यू आर हैविंग दिस टू प्लस एज वेल एज पॉजिटिव एंड नेगेटिव एंड दिस आर द कोलिनियर विद ए बार so we are having only two so answer is two vectors two unit vectors which are collinear with a bar okay next the area of a parallelogram adjacent sides are i plus k and i plus j is plain options are 3 root 3 3 by 2 root 3 by 2 now again the formula for area if we have adjacent side suppose a and b are adjacent side of parallelogram then its area is equal to magnitude of a cross b that is the formula so now here say a vector i plus k so it is 1 0 and b vector is i plus j and this is a 1 1 0 and you can find out a cross b so this is i j k 1 0 1 1 1 so i carry it this is 0 minus 1 then minus j this is 1 into 0 0 Minus one into one, one plus k. We are having this four, so one minus c. So this is minus i plus j plus k. So you can have minus one, 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 and uh, area is the magnitude of a cross b. And so it is root of one plus one plus one, and so it is root three. So answer is root three, option B. Okay. Next, let us see. If x bar and y bar are non collinear non zero vectors then number of unit vectors orthogonal to
both x bar and y bar blank. So options are 2, 4, 0, infinitely many. Now we know if you are having two vectors x bar and y bar then a vector unit vector orthogonal to both so unit vectors orthogonal to both uh, x bar and y bar are plus minus x cross y upon its modulus. So we are having two such vectors. Okay. So option A is there. Next. E the measure of angle between x bar and y bar is theta and x bar dot y bar greater than or equal to 0 then option A 0 less than or equal to theta less than or equal to pi pi by 2 less than or equal to theta less than or equal to pi 0 less than or equal to theta less than or equal to pi by 2 and 0 less than theta less than pi by 2. Now see here measure of angle between x and y bar is theta and x bar and x bar dot y bar positive greater than or equal to theta non negative. Now cosine theta we know it is x dot y upon magnitude x, magnitude y. But because of this is greater than or equal to 0, cosine theta greater than or equal to 0. And that means that uh, theta is in the interval 0 to pi by 2, first quadrant. So, answer is option C. Next. Blank is meaningless A dot B cross C A dot B C A cross B dot C a cross B cross C. So you can observe this. There is a uh, meaningless is this one because this is the scalar and this one is vector. And you cannot have cross product between vector and scalar. So this is meaningless. Okay. So the C option is there for the meaningless. Next, if x bar is i minus j plus k, then y bar 4i plus 3j plus 4k and j 
chair, vector chair is I plus A J plus B K. These are coplanar and magnitude of Z is root 3 then A is blank B is blank so options are 1 minus 1 1 plus minus 1 then plus minus 1 1 and minus 1 plus minus 1. Now the vectors are coplanar. That means this determinant the box must be 0. So the determinant 1 minus 1 1 4 3 4 1 a b that is equal to 0 so this is now 1 into 3 b minus 4 a then minus and minus plus 1 into 4 b minus 4 plus 1 into 4 a minus 3 and it is equal to 0 so this is 3b minus 4a plus 4b minus 4 plus 4a minus 3 is 0. This 4a cancel. 3b plus 4b, 7b minus 4 minus 3, 7. So b equal to 1. Now, so b is 1. Now, uh, magnitude of Z is root 3. So, that is equal to square root of uh, 1 plus A square plus B square equal to root 3. And therefore, 1 plus A square plus B square equal to 3. And if you plug in the value B to be 1, so A square is 1 and therefore A is plus minus 1. So answer is plus minus 1 comma 1. So C option is there. Next. A 3 minus 1. B 2, 3. C, 5, 1. Question is, measure angle is blank. Options are, cosine inverse, 3 upon root 34, pi minus cosine inverse, 3 upon root 34, sin inverse pi by root 34 and pi by 2. Now you are given the vertices of triangle. So when you are having a vertices of triangle like this, so you want to find out this angle. So we need to take this kind of vector. So AB vector and that is a 2 3 minus 3 minus 1 and so this is a minus 1 and 4 and we need a c vector and that is i 1 minus 3 minus 1 and so it is 2 2 and cosine a angle is a a b dot a c over magnitude a b magnitude a c so a b vector so this is minus 1 4 
डॉट टू टू ओवर रूट वन प्लस सिक्सटीन फोर प्लस फोर सो दिस इज माइनस टू प्लस एट एंड ओवर रूट सेवनटीन रूट एट सो दिस इज अक्स ओवर रूट सेवनटीन एंड टू रूट टू सो दी आंसर इज थ्री ओवर रूट थर्टी फोर दैट इज अ को साइन ए एंड देर फॉर ए इक्वल टू को साइन इन वर्स थ्री ओवर रूट थर्टी फोर सो वी आर हैविंग ऑप्शन एस से ए नेक्स्ट लेट एस सी If modulus of x dot y is cosine alpha, then magnitude of x cross y is plane. Options are plus minus sine alpha, sine alpha. माइनस साइन अल्फा साइन स्क्वेर अल्फा नाउ सी दिस वी नो कोसाइन अल्फा एक्स डॉट वाई ओवर मैग्नीट्यूड एक्स मैग्नीट्यूड वाई बट वी आर गिवन मॉड्यूलर्स ऑफ एक्स डॉट वाई एस कॉस अल्फा सो इफ यू टेक दिस इफ यू कंसिडर दिस magnet uh, modulus of x dot y is cosine alpha then we can say that uh, cosine alpha is uh, greater than or equal to 0 because uh, because this x dot y uh, and if i take the cosine alpha like this then this is a uh, and this one is cosine alpha so this is now we can have plus minus 1 equal to 1 upon magnitude x magnitude y so we are having magnitude x magnitude y is plus minus 1 but this side is always uh, positive or non negative so magnitude x magnitude y equal to 1 okay so now magnitude of x cross y so the formula is magnitude x magnitude y sin alpha but this is 1 so magnitude of x cross y equal to sin alpha so answer is b sin alpha next if x dot y is zero then x cross x cross y is blank where magnitude x is 1 option is x cross y x minus y and y cross x so now x cross x cross y so the formula is x dot y outside x minus x dot x and outside y now x dot y is given to be 0 
and this is magnitude x square y but magnitude x is also given to be 1 so x cross x cross y is minus y so option is c minus y thank you mm -hmm.